Biological psychology, also called biopsychology, studies the connection between our biology, our brain, nervous systems, thoughts, feelings and actions. The study of biological psychology, also known as biopsychology, traces its roots back to ancient Greek philosophers like Hippocrates, who suggested that the brain was the seat of intelligence and emotion. During the Renaissance, figures such as René Descartes advanced the idea of dualism, proposing that the mind and body interact but are distinct entities. In the 19th century, Charles Darwin's theory of evolution provided a framework for understanding the biological basis of behavior through natural selection. The early 20th century saw the development of the neuron doctrine by Santiago Ramón y Cajal establishing the neuron as the fundamental unit of the nervous system. Advances in neuroimaging and molecular biology in the late 20th and early 21st centuries have vastly expanded our understanding of the complex interactions between the brain, behavior, and environment. The nervous system is a complex network of nerves and cells that transmit signals between different body parts. It is primarily divided into two main components, the central nervous system, CNS, and the peripheral nervous system, PNS. The CNS, consisting of the brain and spinal cord, acts as the control center, processing information and directing responses. The PNS connects the CNS to limbs and organs, facilitating communication and coordination throughout the body. A neuron is a specialized cell within the nervous system that is responsible for transmitting information throughout the body. It consists of three main parts, the cell body, soma, dendrites, and an axon. The dendrites receive signals from other neurons, while the axon transmits those signals to other cells. Neurons communicate through electrical impulses and chemical signals, playing a crucial role in everything from muscle contraction to complex thought processes. A synapse is a specialized junction between two nerve cells or neurons where communication occurs. This communication is essential for transmitting signals throughout the nervous system. When an electrical signal or action potential reaches the end of a neuron, the presynaptic terminal, it triggers the release of chemical messengers called neurotransmitters. These neurotransmitters cross the tiny gap between neurons known as the synaptic cleft and bind to receptors on the surface of the adjacent neuron, the postsynaptic neuron. This binding can either excite or inhibit the postsynaptic neuron, thus influencing whether it will generate its own action potential. Neurotransmitters play a crucial role in biological psychology by acting as chemical messengers that facilitate communication between neurons in the brain and nervous system. These substances regulate various physiological processes including mood, cognition and behavior. By influencing how neurons transmit signals, neurotransmitters are integral to understanding how the brain functions and how various psychological conditions arise. The human brain is divided into four distinct lobes, each responsible for various critical functions. The frontal lobe, located at the front of the brain, is essential for cognitive functions such as decision-making, problem-solving, and controlling behavior and emotions. It also plays a vital role in voluntary movement and speech production. The parietal lobe, situated behind the frontal lobe, processes sensory information such as touch, temperature, and pain, and is key in spatial orientation and body awareness. The temporal lobe, found beneath the frontal and parietal lobes, is primarily involved in processing auditory information and is also crucial for memory, emotion, and language comprehension. Lastly, the occipital lobe, located at the back of the brain, is dedicated to visual processing. It interprets information from the eyes, allowing us to understand and respond to the visual world. The cerebral cortex is the outermost layer of the brain responsible for complex cognitive functions such as reasoning, language, and decision-making. The limbic system, which includes structures like the hippocampus and amygdala, is crucial for emotional regulation, memory formation, and motivation. The brainstem connecting the brain to the spinal cord regulates essential involuntary functions such as breathing, heart rate, and sleep-wake cycles. Genetics play a pivotal role in the field of biopsychology as it helps to elucidate the complex relationship between our genes and behavior. Researchers can better understand the biological underpinnings of psychological traits and disorders by examining how genetic variations influence neural activity and brain function. For instance, studies on twin and family genetics have highlighted the hereditary nature of conditions like schizophrenia and depression, providing insights into potential genetic markers and targets for treatment. 
This intricate interplay between genetics and biopsychology underscores the importance of considering both biological and environmental factors in the study of human behavior. In biological psychology, MRI, magnetic, resonance imaging is used to create detailed images of the brain's structure aiding in the diagnosis and study of neurological conditions. Functional MRI-FRI goes a step further by measuring and mapping brain activity through changes in blood flow, allowing researchers to observe which areas of the brain are involved in specific mental processes. Electroencephalography records electrical activity in the brain through electrodes placed on the scalp, providing real-time data on brain wave patterns associated with different states of consciousness and cognitive functions. Animal studies involve observing and experimenting with non-human animals to understand the biological underpinnings of behavior and to draw parallels to human psychology. Other research methods, such as PE, T-positron emission tomography, scans and TMS transcranial magnetic stimulation complement these techniques by offering insights into brain metabolism and the effects of brain stimulation on behavior respectively, thus enriching the understanding of the complex relationship between brain and behavior. Biopsychology plays a vital role in understanding and treating mental health conditions by examining how brain structure, neurotransmitters, and genetics influence behavior and emotions, biopsychologists can identify the biological underpinnings of disorders such as depression, anxiety, and schizophrenia. This approach not only helps in the development of targeted medications and interventions, but also fosters a more comprehensive understanding of how both biological and environmental factors can influence mental health. Through this integrated perspective, biopsychology contributes to more effective and personalized treatment plans, ultimately enhancing the quality of life for individuals facing mental health challenges. As biological psychology delves into the intricate relationships between brain function and behavior, it offers crucial insights into neurological degenerative disorders like Alzheimer's and Parkinson's disease. By studying the brain's neural pathways and chemical messengers, researchers can identify the biological underpinnings of these disorders and develop targeted treatments. Techniques such as neuroimaging and electrophysiology allow scientists to observe the progression of brain degeneration in real time. This knowledge not only aids in early diagnosis but also paves the way for innovative therapies to slow or even reverse the effects of these debilitating conditions. Biological psychology examines the brain's role in learning by exploring how neural connections and neurotransmitters influence memory and cognition. This field investigates how different brain regions, such as the hippocampus, are involved in forming and retrieving memories. Research in biological psychology also looks at how factors like sleep and stress hormones affect learning processes. Additionally, age-related changes in the brain, such as decreased plasticity, can impact an individual's ability to learn new information as they grow older. Biopsychology delves into how brain structures and neural pathways influence memory processes. It explores how short-term memory relies on the prefrontal cortex for immediate information processing, while long-term memory storage involves the hippocampus and other cortical areas. Additionally, biopsychology examines conditions like Alzheimer's disease, which affects memory by disrupting neural networks and the production of neurotransmitters essential for cognitive function. Biological psychology provides critical insights into the mechanisms of memory. Biopsychology is crucial in understanding decision-making processes by examining how brain structures, neurotransmitters, and neural pathways influence our choices. Research in this field has shown that areas such as the prefrontal cortex are integral in evaluating risks and rewards, while neurotransmitters like dopamine and serotonin impact our motivation and emotional responses. By exploring these biological underpinnings, biopsychology helps us understand why we make certain decisions and how factors like stress, mental health, and even genetics can affect our judgment and behavior. Let's summarize. Biological psychology is a branch of psychology that explores the intricate relationship between the brain, nervous system, and behavior. This field examines how brain structures and functions influence emotions, thoughts, and actions. Researchers in biological psychology study various aspects, such as neural processes, neurotransmitters, and the effects of genetics and environment on behavior. By utilizing techniques like brain imaging and electrophysiology, they aim to understand mental processes, psychological disorders, and the biological underpinnings of learning, memory, perception, and emotion. This interdisciplinary approach bridges biology and psychology, offering profound insights into the biological basis of human experience.
That was Psyched for Psychology's introduction to Biopsychology. Don't forget to like and subscribe.